hello everyone welcome back to my channel service no universe today in this session we'll discuss about adding the theme and menu to the portal in our last video we have created this portal called service no universe and we don't we have not added a menu and the theme here uh, the theme and menu are empty let me just try it out so this looks empty no header here no footer here so through theme we can add the header and footer we'll see that later but now i just want to remove this uh, button from here so let me just control plus right click here to open the widget in editor i'll remove the button i don't want that button and i'll change this due to h1 uh, so that the text looks bit, um, bit bold let me just refresh this yeah it is looking good but i want that on uh, center so what i'll do is i'll add a class here class header and in the css i'll just add text align center okay cool now we have that uh, here at the center okay now me now let me go back to the portal uh, so we can select the existing theme as well here uh, like Lazola is the existing theme uh, that is the out of the box theme so let me just select that and if I refresh the page that theme is appearing here so in that theme there is no uh, footer here that's why footer is not visible okay so let's just go and create a new theme here themes in service portal themes let's create a new one I'll create service now universe. Okay. Let's add a header as talk header. Okay. That is out of the box one. And footer will create a new one. Okay. To create the footer, uh, we'll go to headers and footers section under service portal. So all the headers and footers are nothing but the widgets itself, but uh, those are added in this uh, headers and footers uh module okay and the table name is sp header and footer okay so let me create a new footer here service now universe footer it's uh better to add the id here okay uh, in this uh, i'll not add anything i'll just add all rights Result. Let me just save this. Okay, I think that is already present. Let me just. Okay, let's open that one only then. Yeah, service no inverse footer is already there. So we have added the code here. Let me just go and in the theme yeah here is the theme i'll select that service now universe footer now uh, you can notice uh, both header and footer are fixed now okay now let me go just to uh, the page yeah okay in the portal we have not added that that's why so let me open the portal okay let me replace uh, lazola with service now universe universe yeah this one Okay, so if I refresh the page now, okay, now we can see uh, the header is there already and uh, the footer is also visible. Okay, and now this is as this is fixed, this is attached to the bottom of the screen here. So now uh, let me just increase the content on this page. So let me just go here, I'll just add this multiple times. let me save this yeah and let me refresh this page again so we have got the uh, scroll bar here uh, even though i am scrolling uh, the header is not changing uh, the header and the footer is not changing okay you can see those are fixed here so that is uh, that is this header and footer are fixed so if i uh, uncheck this fixed footer and if i refresh the page now now the footer is not fixed here 
okay it is at the bottom of the page okay all right Sriza. so it is uh, about that so let me make it fixed footer and let me save this okay and i'll remove uh, this all from here we don't want that okay now this uh, blue color uh, if you want to change that blue color there is a branding editor here in service portal we have service portal configuration if you go to service portal configuration we uh, have this branding editor here so uh, we need to select the portal for which we need to uh, make the changes so we have selected service now universe here in the theme colors we can just change the theme color here okay. we just select something okay. that will be uh, added here okay now let me go to the page and refresh this that uh, theme is here okay that color is applied here okay so we can change the color of the uh, this divider okay this is the divider color i can add it anything Uh, divider color is changed and i can add the color for the links i can add the color for the text here so we can do uh, the changes from here from branding branding editor okay uh, let's create the menu now uh, let me go to the navigation and type menus here under service portal menus i get this option here so let me create a new one okay uh, i'll say service now universe menu Okay. so when we uh, create when, when we are creating the menu right so we have to select the widget here okay. there are out of the box three widgets so I'll select a header menu widget we can customize that as well uh, but we'll discuss that in our upcoming videos okay. for now uh, we have inserted the menu and uh, let me just go back to uh, the portal and add that menu here service now universe menu and let me save this okay uh, so now let me go to the uh, page and refresh this okay. now we got one uh, option for tours here okay this is added by service now itself whenever we create a new menu this will be added we can remove that uh, so we can see that later but in the menu when we add that in the related list we get menu items here okay let me just click on new we can add uh, multiple types of menus here one is page we can add another service now portal page a service portal page and URL we can add some URL service catalog we can uh, add the service catalog to request the uh, request something okay so we have many options here so let me just add a type of URL and I'll add Google and the URL is https colon slash slash Google dot com okay and I want to open this in a new tab that's why I'll say underscore blank just save this and let me refresh the page now okay we have got this option for uh, Google here now when I click that uh, it, it will open the uh, Google website in the new tab okay so let me go back and add one more here let me say incidents and I'll say filtered list now i'll select the table that is incident okay yeah and i'll select the filter that is active true active true uh, let me change the order uh, google is at 100th order let me add this at 200th order so. okay uh, let me refresh the page now okay now we have incidents also here uh, we have Google we have got incidents when I click on incidents and it shows me the count how many active incidents are present in the system and uh, when I click on that it shows us the list of the active incidents when I click on any of them uh, it will just open the uh, form here uh, in this portal okay so this is how we can add the menus here okay this is all about setting the theme and the menu if you like this video then please hit the thumb icon and please add your valuable suggestions in the comment and if you are not subscribed to the channel 
then please subscribe thank you